Hello, boys and girls, my name is Alcesti and welcome back to another episode of Oxygen Not Included, where we are finally making a bit of progress. Uh, so we can actually thinking about venturing a bit more to the uh, outside as we are trying to do. Um, then I have been thinking this setup does not seem to produce enough hydrogen uh, to have any excess uh, to go in here so maybe what we can do is uh, go into one of uh, these rooms and uh, uh, steal the, the hydrogen from there so for example from here we have quite quite a bit so if we go down in below and then have a, a pump all the way at the top, uh, we should catch the, the hydrogen. So that means we need a ladder that goes further down. Because only if we can get some hydrogen in here, uh, we can start shearing the draclets and drakus, so we can get the reed fiber and, more importantly, the uh, plastic. So then. Last thing, we also placed a storage bin here, and you might wonder what this is all about. Um, we want to have a bit of water in here, and as soon as that happens, right now, we can deconstruct this pump and then basically copy the settings over to here and deconstruct this one and with that we can get rid of uh, this uh, water here because then we will store the slime and the bleach stone and the uh, oxalite over here next to our uh, mushroom farm where we actually need the uh, the slime so we have a shorter shorter way and then we can put in another layer down here uh, if we dig this out we should be able to uh, mop it up I hope can wrangle you now are we looking temperature wise we're going in with 50 plus going out with 25 it's still a bit on the on the warm side but once we have uh, oxygen in here, um, we will get really a, a good cooldown. Ok, 
Okay. Nice. Um espresso machine. And for our uh, set up over there we need a bit of uh, power and a bridge on here right Research complete, um, which means we have to queue up some more. And we are currently just um, going through all the uh, stuff that's still open. Um, no uh, uh, peculiar order. So, door in here, then we want to have a grooming station, um, we want to have a feeder, and a creature drop off. Right. Nice. Which means then we can basically extend the ladder all the way down. Dig everything out. And this room down here will be a bit higher. Does not really matter. Because I think for the for the farm we could have the room a bit bigger. So it does not hurt have it uh, a bit higher right um. that's dangerous business you're doing there more of the same down here all right we can add a few more storage bins over here on this side we don't need ladder here anymore and let's see what we get um, we do have 11 uh, duplicates I think we can have one more but as we have covered all our basic needs uh, let's wait for one uh, with really good traits um, and 
none of these have them so uh, let's take a bit of uh, fish attack them and that will give us uh, nice fillets of fish so we can extend our uh, diet or diversify our diet Alright, and here on this side we started with the uh, setup for our cooling water tank. And basically, um, the water we have we pump out here that will be the water that will be cooled down and we will drop it back in at the top and then the other three those are actually the pumps to uh, uh, to power the, uh, the the cooling loop of the uh, various uh, rooms and uh, systems and whatnot. Nice. Uh, these are set up. So uh, let's copy the settings. And Let's try to get all the bleach stone and the uh, outer nasty stuff over here stored away. Uh, and more research done. So this one is next. And with this speed we should be done with the uh, with the uh, research pretty soon. We're also trying to dig uh, down here a bit more which we are making uh, progress so we can actually reach this store here however the uh, atmosphere is not really favorable um, as it's carbon dioxide and next research is done so i think that's the next from the top okay lot of moving around and at this point I think we have too many things to do for our duplicants um, so that they would uh, get anything done. Yeah, they get to about this point down here and then they uh, figure out uh, oh, can't breathe down there. So let's go back up. 
And the bleach zone dropped back down. I wish they would not do that. But we cannot help it. It is how it is. Um, dig this out as well. Nice. This ladder here is also built, so let's build the last piece and then the uh, polluted water should drop down here on this side. Plumbing-wise, as these three pumps are pumping out the cool water, we will use isolated, um, isolated uh, uh, pipes. So, at the first go down here, and the second like this. And then we can have the third like this. We have 10 beds and 11 duplicates, which means somebody is sleeping on the floor. is not all that great so let's put some more cuts up here then uh, we have so many new stuffs I have not yet looked at things we do not really need um, we will create a power wire up on this side. And then actually that's not too clever. Um, because we can also go out here at the top. Wrong button. Here. And thereby save a bit of wiring. Progress is slow, but um, at least we're making some. Have we gone around to open this door yet? No. 
Of course not. And these will be two more hatch farms because you can never have too many hatches. Uh, we then only have to be a bit careful with uh, what we are uh, uh, feeding them um, because we do not have limitless uh, supply. And with that we are at the end of this episode. Hope you enjoyed it and turn in uh, for the next time when it's oxygen not included once again. See ya!